So now let's see how we can work with shape and line fill, line type and color inside of Google Slides. So for that, I'm going to go around and bring in a shape. Let's say, for example, I want to bring in this shape right here, the no smoking shape. And then I'm going to bring in a line as well. So I'm just going to go to curb and click it to make curb just like this. And there you go. So now I'm going to select both of these and then I'm going to add in a color to them. So to add in a color, I can go over here, go to fill color. And if I were to select a color, what happens is that it is filled out. So you can see that this shape right here, it's completely filled out inside. But in this one, you can see that the last point and the first point, they assume to be joined together and the color was filled just like this. I can go over here and then make it transparent as well. So I can fill it a color, fill color or not. That is up to me. I'm going to leave this as it is. Now, let me just go over here and then I can fill this out with custom colors as well as in with any other shapes and I can fill it with gradient as well. So I can go around and select some kind of gradient for this and go to custom gradient as well, where I can choose the type of gradient. Let's say, for example, I want to make that more red or I'm going to go around, make that more like pink and I can go around here, add in a point, change that out. And then let's say, for example, change that out into orange. I can also change the angle and the type of the gradient. So I can press that and that is how it actually works out, as you can see. So that is how you can add in a color. Another thing that you can do is you can work around with border colors. So you can go around and change the border color and you can see that now it is yellow. I can do the same right here. I can choose another color and there you go. That's the border color. Let me select both of them and here you can see that there's border weight. So I can go around, increase the border weight according to how I like as well. So you can see that they are much more bolder over there. So I can go around over here on the line dash, change the type of the line as well. So you can go around over here, change the type and that is how it works out. You can change the type of the dash right here. So it's all dots and you can change around the border weight and it's all dots as you can see right here. And this gives you a lot of options, as you can see. So this gives you a lot of options right there to, uh, um, uh, to get the looks that you want. And that is how you can work with shape and line fill, line type and color options inside of Google Slides. So if you guys learn something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.